TCGplayer.com. This is TCGplayer.com with our review of all the products and hot new upcoming releases in collectible gaming straight from Gen Con Indianapolis. In this episode, we feature the Eye of Judgment, a joint effort between Sony Computer Entertainment and Wizards of the Coast. Coming out on October 23rd, this game combines the card game powerhouse that is Wizards with the graphical and online ability of the PlayStation 3. For fans of trading card games that have always imagined their cards coming to life, the Eye of Judgment brings that dream to the PS3. The Eye of Judgment game comes with a PlayStation Eye, a camera stand, a play mat, a starter of 30 cards, and a booster. Players are able to customize their decks as in normal trading card games, but then these characters come to life via the PSI. First, let's talk about the decks and cards. Cards consist of spells and creatures in five different elements. Fire, which is red. Water, which is blue. Wood, which is green. Earth, which is yellow. And Biolith, which is gray. The field is made up of nine squares, with all five elements being represented. The goal is to have control of five of the nine fields, or to deplete your opponent's deck. The strategy mirrors that of previous card games, but the changing field of play and various attacks of the creatures adds to the complexity, making nearly every game different. There are 90 creatures and 20 spells in set 1, with 5 30 card precons available at launch. Boosters are 8 cards, 1 rare or ultra rare, 2 uncommons, and 5 commons. There are also phantom ultra rares, cards that you won't know what they are until they spawn on the field of play. There are 5 phantoms in all. Eye of Judgment offers 4 game modes. You can play the game standalone without the PlayStation against another player, against the AI with 5 levels of difficulty, PvP on the PS3, and online against other players, a feature available straight from launch. In addition, you can have the gameplay simulated matches AI vs AI to try and test your deck to see what works and what doesn't. Online play will have global rankings, and you can even play against online AI to unlock special titles. There will be community building and other such features announced closer to launch. There should be an expansion in February, with three to four expansions released per year. All in all, the Eye of Judgment was one of the most exciting products we saw at Gen Con Indianapolis, and one we're sure to check out soon. For more of the latest releases in gaming, be sure to check out the rest of our Gen Con Indianapolis coverage at tcgplayer.com slash gencon.